fine. I just need to take a minute. I'm very tempted not to give you one. The cradle. Did you get it? Stark will take care of it. No, he won't. You don't know what you're talking about. Stark's not crazy. He will do anything to make things right. Stark, come in. Stark. Anyone on comms? Ultron can't tell the difference between saving the world and destroying it. Where do you think he gets that? Anything on that? I haven't heard, but she's alive or Ultron will be rubbing our faces in it. This is sealed tight. We're gonna need to access the program, break it down from within. Any chance Natasha might leave you a message outside the internet, old school spy stuff? There's some that second cast. Yeah, all right, I'll find her. I can work on tissue degeneration if you could fry whatever operational system Cho implanted. Yeah, about that. No. You have to trust me. Kind of don't. Our ally? The guy protecting the military's nuclear codes? I found him. Hello, Dr. Banner. Ultron didn't go after Jarvis because he was angry. He attacked him because he was scared of what he can do. So Jarvis went underground, right? Scattered, dumped his memory, but not his protocols. He didn't even know he was in there until I pieced him together. So, you want me to help you put Jarvis into this thing? No, of course not. I want to help you put Jarvis in this thing. We're out of my field here. You know bioorganics better than anyone. And you just assume that Jarvis's operational matrix can beat Ultron's? Jarvis has been beating him from inside without knowing it. This is the opportunity. We can create Ultron's perfect self without the homicidal glitches he thinks are his winning personality. We have to. I believe it's worth a go. I'm, I'm in a loop. I'm caught in a time loop. This is exactly where it all went I know. wrong. I know. I know what everyone's going to say, but they're already saying it. We're mad scientists. We're monsters, buddy. We've got to own it. Make a stand. 